Hi, my name is Sam Muir and I run the I Love Classical Ukulele website and blog and the I Love Classical Ukulele Facebook page and Facebook group. Welcome to tutorial 5 of this 10 tutorial course called Back to Basics, Finger Picking for the Ukulele. In tutorial 4 we looked at alternating finger movement across the strings. In this tutorial we're going to apply alternating or walking fingers to playing repeated notes on the same string. Now alternating or walking fingers is a technique that should be practiced until it feels as natural and comfortable as walking on two legs. These simple repeated exercises played slowly and methodically will help you to achieve this. Let's begin with the I and M fingers playing repeated notes on the C string. The thumb rests lightly on the G string to add stability to the hand and help keep it in position. Note how the index finger strikes the string and springs back into position before the M finger plays. And similarly, the M strikes and springs back into position before the I plays. To help improve this action, we can apply the finger spring exercise. The I plays and the M finger springs onto the string and stops the sound. And similarly, when the M plays, the I drops onto the string. What we're aiming for is a staccato or short and detached sound. And this exercise forces the fingers to spring back into position. When we return to legato strokes, the finger springs back into position, but this time without touching the string. So that's legato and then staccato. One way to practice this exercise is to play four notes on the C string four notes on the E string four notes on the A string four notes on the E string finally returning to the C string. Note how when I shifted from the E string up to the A I allowed my thumb to move position from resting on the G to resting on the C. You might like to practice all six finger combinations so that's I M like we've just done and then you can switch to M I then I A a I, M A, and finally A M. Good luck and see you in tutorial six.